In this video, we're going to go from this to this using this. Okay, so uh, I've got the obvious flashing, blinking light up here. And tired of fluorescence, so I wanted to go to LED bulbs. And uh, these had pretty good reviews, so I thought, what the heck, I'll give it a shot. Now there are some that claim that you can just swap these in with the ballast still in there. These do not say that, and I really don't want to do that anyway because I'd like to get rid of the ballast. So, first thing I'm going to do is turn off the power up there, and then remove the ballast, and, and just wire these things direct. So the same process can apply to any fluorescent light, but I just happen to be doing this on my basement ceiling lights. The first thing you do is open it up and get rid of the bulbs. Oh, I hate this part. That's why I want to get rid of them. Be sure to recycle the bulbs accordingly. Okay, so again, make sure that the power is turned off to the lights because you don't want to shock yourself. And if you're not confident doing something like this, then hire an electrician, right? Okay, so this one actually doesn't look like it has any screws holding it in. So, squeeze that. And this is a double ballast type because it has four bulbs. If you just have two, there'll just be a single ballast in there. All right, so next we'll be getting rid of all this garbage. So I'm going to cut the ballast loose and try to leave myself as much wire as possible here. And there's the second one out. Okay, this is the Jessla T8 four foot tubes. And on here, that shows the correct wiring is, after you cut them out, for my setup anyway, um, shows the black wire going to the red and blue wires, and then the white wire goes to the yellow. So I'll have to strip these back and, and wire those accordingly. So again, black wire goes to red and blue, so those will all be tied together. And then the white wire goes to the yellow. Okay, screw that down good and tight. All right, then I'm gonna go ahead and tape it, make sure it doesn't come off.
And next, white will go to yellow. All right, and the same thing down here. I'm gonna cut all these so they're the same length. this off Make sure this white one comes over far enough. Cut it. Like so. Right, there's the black ones together for the white. Okay, next we'll be to stuff the wires back up in there.
Okay, got all the wires up in the channel run. Now to install bulbs. Probably just gonna run with two. Take these off the ends first. Got a little protective covers on there. Okay, make sure that they're pointed down. I'm curious if it'll turn on with just one. Hey, it will. Take the protective cover off. And there we go. Um, I don't particularly. I don't like. I'll turn these off real quick. All right, and there it is with the LEDs in there. Uh, these have a little bit of a blue tint to them, and of course there'll be a link to these bulbs, these exact bulbs, in the description. Uh, if you if you need it brighter, then of course put four in. So I'm going to go ahead and do the other one here beside it, and uh, I think it's going to I think it's going to work out well for me. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please select like down there and subscribe to my channel. If you didn't like it, well, subscribe to the channel. Maybe you like the next one. Thank you for watching.